The nation is home to the world's largest pork market and largest hog population on Earth. But scenes like this have played out across China since August 2018, when African swine fever started wiping out pig herds. Estimated 200 million pigs have died. Of That's right. Not only that, China is suffering from the coronavirus, they're also suffering from the African swine fever, which kills and affects 80% of all pigs. So harmless to humans, the virus is deadly for pigs. An estimated 200 million pigs have died or were called so far. 200 million pigs, that's insane. 200 million, that's 25%, a quarter of the Earth's population of pigs. China's government has been desperate to stabilize pork prices amid the outbreak. Millions of tons of pork have been imported. The central government has also released 22,000 tons of meat from its strategic pork reserves. That's a lot of meat, holy smokes. The wholesale market cost of a single kilogram of pork was 45 yuan in January 2020. That's more than double the 19 yuan consumers pay around the same time last year. Ouch, time to stop eating pork and move on to something else. <laughs> Nice if you're all for fish, but I don't like anything from the ocean considering all the radiation from the Japanese nuclear plants. There's currently no vaccine for swine fever. And as the epidemic spreads to neighboring countries such as Japan and South Korea, pricey pork seems likely to be stuck on the menu in China for the foreseeable future. All they're worried about is the prices of pork going up. How about the all the pigs dying, we should be worried about that. Pigs are awesome, yo. Like, just imagine if 200 million people died. Like, people would just be like, oh my god, but 200 million pigs die, and I don't think too many people have heard about it. So do the pigs a favor, stop eating pork and bacon and all sorts of stuff like that that's pig-related, which I'm gonna do as well. Like this video for the pigs, share it to spread awareness, and subscribe. It only takes two seconds, and I really appreciate it. But yeah, it's just insane. I can't believe that. And I'll keep you updated with any more updates on the swine flu as well. African swine fever, actually. But anyways, you all take care. Peace out.